Today, I'll show you how to create a virtual machine using Hyper-V in Windows Server 2012. To get started, click on Start button, type vertmgmt.msc to open up the Hyper-V Management Console. Once the Management Console is open and loaded, on the right-hand side in the Actions pane, click New, Virtual Machine. From there, the wizard will pop up. We can just ignore the first screen. Type the name of your virtual machine and then choose to store it in a specific location. Choose either Generation 1 or Generation 2 depending on your needs. You can read this for more information. Set the amount of memory for the virtual machine. Choose which virtual switch you would like to connect the virtual machine to. And then either create a virtual hard disk or attach an existing virtual hard disk. From here, we can choose whether we want to install the operating system later, or if we want to choose an ISO file to install. On the summary page, make sure all of your settings are correct, and then hit Finish. Once the virtual machine is created, we can right-click and choose Settings. Then we can change our processor amount. I'm going to change this to 8. From here, we can also change the memory, either increase or decrease. We can change the ISO image that we want to boot to, or add additional external hard drives. Once you're done, start the virtual machine and start installing your operating system.